Who dat? He's bringing the sound of New Orleans right here to the Lehigh Valley. Easton native and Phillipsburg area resident Jeremy Joseph is here to talk about taking his music to the streets of Easton. Jeremy, thanks for joining us. Thanks so much for having me. Of course. So the Big Easy Easton Brass has become quite the local sensation. How did the group form? Well, I wanted to start a community band because uh, I know after high school there's not a lot of opportunities for people to play in amateur bands. Um, if you're not a professional, music kind of goes out of your life. And I know in the Lehigh Valley, we have such a proud mm -hmm. tradition of marching bands in the high schools right. here. I was East in 95. Uh, so I really want to encourage people to go and take the instrument out of their closet, start working on their chops again, and just jump into the parade anytime they can and play along with us. People here in this corner of the United States can get a little bit of flavor from New Orleans. Why did you think it was important to bring that here? Well, you know, the New Orleans culture, ever since Katrina, those bands started to come out and do national tours like the Rebirth Brass Band and Trombone yeah. Shorty. Trombone Shorty was just at Music Fest last year. So this music is just really powerful. And you watch on YouTube, you just see this small little brass band going down the street with hundreds of people just following them, dressed in beautiful dresses and doing certain kind of dances. And it's just a really great community event. Of course. All right. Well, as they say in New Orleans, laissez les bon temps rouler. Let the wow. good times roll, right? Very good. You said that well. All Thanks. right. <laughs> Take it away, Jeremy. Okay. So, well, what we're talking about is the second line parade is what we're doing in Easton. So that culture of the second line parade is what it's called. And it comes from a jazz funeral. It comes from where the first line was the brass band and the second line was the congregation of the church. And at a funeral, they'd go from the church to the gravesite, and they play sad music, something like St. James Infirmary. And then they bury the body and say their songs and say their words, and then they would want to play happy music on the way back to celebrate that, per that person's life. So they play something like When the Saints Go Marching In. So this tradition, it just started more and more to go away from funerals, and they started to do it for weddings and birthdays. Mm -hmm. And now in New Orleans, they just do it for any old reason. They'll start outside the French Quarter with about 50 people, and by the time they get into the French Quarter, they got 500 people following them in the band. So I think it's a great community event. It's something that we're bringing to Easton. And how are you trying to bring it to the Lehigh Valley? How can people hear this music? So right now, uh, Every fourth Friday, Easton Out Loud, we do a parade. So here tonight, we start 7 o'clock behind the Easton Public Market, and we'll parade around the streets of Easton and end at the Bayou in Easton. If people want to find out more about the Big Easy Easton Brass, um, where can they go online? Sure, so EastonBrass.com is our website, but we're on Facebook and have a lot of videos there and okay. Instagram, so just search Big Easy Easton Brass. Okay, wonderful. And before I let you go, anything else you want to add? Uh, just it's again it's we want you to play your instrument again if you had played it in high school and you stopped playing it's time to pick it up and just jump in well thanks again for joining us jeremy thank you so much